the world's easiest hands-free can opener. This is the Toucan as seen on TV. Let's get this thing opened up and see if it works like it's supposed to. The Toucan is unpackaged. It's a pretty nice little unit. I mean, pretty basic. Not very heavy, but not light. It is large. I mean, this is pretty good size, but you can see it does look like a toucan. Here's the eye, here's the beak. A lot of people say it looks like a bug if you look at it that way, but once you think about the beak, yeah, it does kind of look like a toucan. Also includes, kind of weird, but these bulbhead.com stickers. I don't know why those are in there, but has some basic instructions, again, referencing that it is the world's easiest hands-free can opener some basic stuff about the batteries and putting it on the can and I thought this was interesting you can also use the beak to seal the unseal the lid on hard to open jars you can use it as a bottle opener or if you're really into using large accessories to do small things you can use it to open the tabs on like soda cans soups things like that uh, now I've already put batteries in this thing but to get them in you have a little tab here you just pop that tab, this whole cover comes off. You put the batteries in. Now, when I did put the batteries in, it started spinning. And it stayed on for just a second, and then it stopped. I'm assuming, and I tried it again, and it did the same thing. So I'm assuming maybe the button is pressing when it is closed. So, I have here a can of tamales that I'm kind of craving tonight. Don't know why, it's kind of weird. But this is one of those can openers, one of the new type can openers that is supposed to unseal the can along this lip rather than making those jagged cuts that you'll get on a traditional can opener. So, see how it works. It says that you put the can edge in between here. So I'm gonna do that. And then it says you press the button to start and press it to stop see what happens okay. it's not super fast but let's let it go all the way around I'll stop it and we will see if the lid comes off this can almost there okay okay so it kind of backs itself up Thought something was a magnet, but let's see if it actually. Yes, it did. Look at that. Wow, some like can glue or something on this. <laughs> kind of weird. So, okay. So, you don't have jagged edges, but apparently on some cans, you have some can sealant. So, I don't know how I feel about that, but it does work. I'll wipe my fingers off here. Well, I'm actually really impressed with this can opener. I just bought a new Kenmore can opener that I like, but man, this is really, really nice. It's a little large, so you know, got some drawer space concerns, but man, it actually works. I mean, that is not sharp at all. This thing is not sharp. A little dirty, but not sharp. Only downside I can see is this can sealant stuff. I don't know how unhealthy if that gets down in there. I don't know what that's made of, but yeah, it actually works. So just a quick close-up of the unit again. Turn it over. Just place your can edge there. Turn it on. I mean, it works really well. This beak supposedly helps you open jars. And there you can see the bottle opener. Takes four AA batteries. See how long those last. But man, it's pretty quick. It works well. Uh, I'm a fan. So close this out just by giving a quick look again at the box. More importantly, let me give you the item number on the box. So you can buy this at Bed Bath & Beyond, I think Target, anywhere that sell, sells the As Seen on TV items. As Seen on TV. Again, toucan can opener. I like it. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go eat some tamales. One slight correction I wanted to make. I said you would use the toucan beak there to open or loosen the seal on jars. Not true. You would hook it in on this little hook so you don't use the beak at all. Just wanted to correct that. 